And if everybody would like to be seated now. So firstly, may I wish everyone a very warm welcome to Mitten Hall, where we have gathered to celebrate the marriage of Diane and Mike. I'm Malcolm Binns and myself and my friend and colleague Gemma Topping are here on behalf of Lancashire Registration Services. I will be conducting today's ceremony and Gemma is here to make sure all the legal requirements are met and to make a permanent record of your marriage. We consider ourselves very lucky in the jobs we do and privileged to be part of such a special occasion in people's lives. And on behalf of Diane and Mike, I would like to thank you all for being here today to witness the start of this new phase in their life together. So by tradition, starting with the gentleman, can you confirm for me your full name, please? Uh, Michael Dennis Hull. Thank you. And Diane Margaret Barlow. Thank you very much. The purpose of marriage is that you may always love, care, and support each other through all the joys and sorrows of life, and that love may be fulfilled in a relationship of permanent and continuing commitment. We trust that these things will come true for you both. Mike, will you take Diane to be your lawful wedded wife? Will you love, respect, and care for her? I will. Thank you. Diane, will you take Mike to be your lawful wedded husband? Will you love, respect and care for him? I will. This place in which we are now met has been duly sanctioned according to law for the celebration of marriages. You are gathered here today to witness the joining in matrimony of Michael Dennis Hull and Diane Margaret Barlow. If there is any person here present who knows of any lawful impediment to this marriage, they should declare it now. During the ceremony today, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to have two readings, and at this stage we'll have the first reading. So if I could ask Chris to come forward, please. Marriage. Today your adventure begins. Hand in hand you step out into a new life. Side by side, strong in unity. Together in friendship, in love. Two hearts become one. Soulmates, friends, lovers. Lost, now found, no longer alone. Bonded in happiness, contentment. Love will guide you, protect you, carry you forward together. Look to your future, share the sunshine, share the rain. Grow together, trusting, supporting, caring. For your dreams are waiting, your marriage begins. Before you are joined in matrimony, I have to remind you of the solemn and binding character of the vows you are about to make. Marriage, according to the law of this country, is the union of one man with one woman voluntarily entered into for life to the exclusion of all others. Now I am going to ask each of you in turn to declare that you do not know of any lawful reason why you should not be married to each other. So again, starting with you, Mike, can you repeat after me? I do solemnly declare. I do solemnly declare. That I know not. That I know not. Of any lawful impediment. Of any lawful impediment. Why I, Michael Dennis Hull. Why I, Michael Dennis Hull. May not be joined in matrimony. May not be joined in matrimony. To Diane Margaret Barlow. To Diane Margaret Barlow. Thank you. Diane. I do solemnly declare. I do solemnly declare. That I know not. That I know not. Of any lawful impediment. Of any lawful impediment. Why I, Diane Margaret Barlow. Why I, Diane Margaret Barlow. May not be joined in matrimony. May not be joined in matrimony. To Michael Dennis Hull. To Michael Dennis Hull. Thank you very much. 
And now the solemn moment has come for Mike and Diane to make the contract of their marriage before you, their witnesses. So can I ask you to turn and face each other? As you say these vows to each other, again starting with you, Mike, can you repeat after me? I call upon... I call upon... These persons here present... These persons here present... To witness that I, Michael Dennis Hull... To witness that I, Michael Dennis Hull... Do take thee, Diane Margaret Barlow... To take thee, Diane Margaret Barlow... To be my lawful wedded wife... To be my lawful wedded wife... Thank you. And Diane? I call upon... I call upon... These persons here present... These persons here present... To witness that I, Diane Margaret Barlow... To witness that I, Diane Margaret Barlow... Do take thee, Michael Dennis Hull. Do take thee, Michael Dennis Hull. To be my lawful wedded husband. To be my lawful wedded husband. Thank you very much. And Diane and Mike have chosen to say some extra words to each other to celebrate their love for each other on this very special day in their lives. So again, starting with you, Mike, can you repeat after me? Diane, I promise... Diane, I promise to be your husband in times of joy. To be your husband in times of joy. And in times of trouble. And in times of trouble. To provide for and support you. To provide for and support you. In friendship, trust and love. In friendship, trust and love. I promise to work with you. I promise to work with you. To build our lives together. To build our lives together. May our love bring us closer. May our love bring us closer. To create a home. To create a home. Filled with peace, happiness and love. Filled with peace, happiness and love. Thank you very much. And Diane? Mike, I also promise. Mike, I also promise. To be your wife in times of joy. To be your wife in times of joy. And in times of trouble. And in times of trouble. To provide for and support you. To provide <coughs> for and support you. In friendship, trust and love. In friendship, trust and love. I promise to work with you. I promise to work with you. To build our lives together. To build our lives together. May our love bring us closer. May our love bring us closer. To create a home. To create a home. Filled with peace, happiness and love. Filled with peace, happiness and love. Thank you very much. And at this stage, ladies and gentlemen, we'll have the second reading. If I could ask Jed to come forward, please. <clears throat> the Art of Marriage by Wilfred A. Peterson. A good marriage must be created. In the art of marriage, the little things are the big things. <clears throat> it has never been too old to hold hands. <laughs> it is remembering to say, I love you at least once a day. It's never going to sleep angry. It's having a mutual sense of values and common objectives. It's forming a circle of love that encapsulates a whole family. It is speaking words of appreciating, <laughs> appreciation and demonstrating gratitude in a very thoughtful way. It's having the capacity to forgive and forget. It is finding room for the things of the spirit. It is giving each other the atmosphere in which each other can grow. It is the common search for not only the good, but the beautiful. It is not only marrying the right partner, it is being the right partner. Thank you. And we have now come to the exchange of rings. If I could ask for the rings, please. I could just take, if you could take the box away. Thank you, Thank you very much. This is the traditional way of sealing the vows you have just made. Your wedding ring is the unbroken circle, symbolising unending and everlasting love. 
and is the outward sign of the lifelong promise you have made to each other. Wear them with a feeling of love and pride, now and always. So, Mike, if you take Diane's ring, I'm placing it on her ring finger and holding it halfway down. Can you repeat after me? I give you this ring. I give you this ring. As a symbol of our marriage. As a symbol of our marriage. And as a token of my love for you. And as a token of my love for you. And place it on a finger. You can help him, Diane. It's a partnership now. <laughs> Thank you. And if you'd like to take Mike's ring, I'm placing it on his ring finger and holding it halfway down. Can you repeat after me? I accept your ring. I accept your ring. And in return, I give you this ring. And in return, I give you this ring. As a symbol of our marriage. As a symbol of our marriage. And as a token of my love for you. And as a token of my love for you. And place it on his finger. <laughs> Make sure it's firmly on <laughs> hold. <laughs> Marriage is a commitment to life, to the best that two people bring out in each other. Within the circle of its love, it encompasses all life's most important relationships. It is a promise a potential made in the hearts of two people who love, which takes a lifetime to fulfil. May you always be the reason for each other's happiness. And as you begin this new phase in your life together, may all the happiness you now share be as beautiful and endless as the rings you now wear. You have both made the declarations prescribed by law and you have made a solemn and binding contract with each other in the presence of your witnesses, family and friends here today. It is my privilege and pleasure to tell you that you are now husband and wife. You may kiss the bride. <laughs> you to come round to this side of the table now. If you let Diane through, Mike. And then she can come through into the centre. If I just pull your dress through with you, so that you're comfortable sat down. There we go. You get to sit down. And Mike, if you'd like to come and stand next to your wife, because now you have to be Thank <laughs> you. 